Hello everyone, hope you all are healthy and safe wherever you are. Today I bring to you a new fun topic in grammar to do with your kids in this quarantine period. Now punctuations are a very difficult topic in grammar for children to visualize and even understand why are we using such kind of symbols. But if you add a little bit of twist and a little bit of fun to it, it can be really really interesting and also get in some fun in a very mundane and boring topic. So as the name suggests, punctuation. So why don't we add a little punch to it? Punctuations or Kung Fu punctuations. So we are going to add fun Kung Fu moves to our punctuations. So let me discuss them with you. So first, let's talk about the capital letter. Now before any two uh, opponents, you know, get into a fight or a Kung Fu, uh, you know, standoff, what do they do? They bow down to each other. So for every capital letter, you take your bow stance and then you go capital letter. Let's try it together. Capital letter and bow down. For a full stop, you're going to have a hard hitting punch, right? So every time you come across a full stop, it's going to be ha. Let's practice it together. Ha. If it's going to be a comma. Okay. Let's try this move. With your right hand, you go she. With your right hand, let's go, comma, she. Now, if you have an exclamation mark, it's like a standing line and a full stop. So, combination of two movements will come here. So, let's look at exclamation mark. She, ha. Once again, she, ha. Semicolon. Again, full stop and a comma together. So, ha, she, ha, she. That's going to be your semicolon. Now, what about question mark? Hmm. That's a little complicated to do, right? Let's try this. Question mark. She, 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 ha. Again. She, 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 ha. Right. Which is my favorite. Quotations. Okay. So if a person is talking in first uh, figure speech, and uh, so that would be your quotes. So you go. Bling, 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 bling. All right. So you can either do the bling, bling, bling movement or you can go. Ee. So basically, you just lift your both hands and you do the nice bird pose and you go. Ee. So <laughs> these are your fun exclamation and punctuation marks. Now, how do you convert it into book reading? So if you have any kind of book and you're reading it, so... You start with a book and then you simply just go according to the punctuation marks. Capital letter. Ants. She. Ha. Because there was an exclamation mark. Capital letter. Ants. Spin. Ha. Capital letter. Ants. Spin. She. Spin. She. Spin. She. Spin. She ha isn't this fun? <laughs> Capital letter ants spin in a pan. Ha. Capital letter ants spin in a tin. Ha. Capital letter t t t tap. She ha. Capital letter. T, tap, she, tap, she, tap, she, ha. Capital letter, tip, she, ha. Capital letter, ha, she, ha. Capital letter, ants, sit, ha. Capital letter, ants, nap, ha. And and ants finished. So why don't you try 
this fun little exercise with your kids. So let's practice this one more time. Full stop. Ha! Capital letter. Post turns. Comma. She. Uh, semicolon. Ha! She. Colon. Ha! Ha! Uh, exclamation mark. She. Ha! Question mark. She. 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 Ha! So hope you have fun with my Kung Fu punctuation and I'll see you in the next video.